Hey guys, Wells Knight here, and welcome back to another episode of Simply Magic. And in today's episode, I would really like to get my hands on one of the bags from Witching Gadgets. Uh, specifically, it, one that will essentially increase the amount of stuff that we can carry with us at any given time. That would be very, very useful. Um, in order to do that, I need to make a spinning wheel from Witching Gadgets, which is an iron ingot, a table, and... Uh, any type of plank. So all of that should be pretty easy to make. Let's just grab some stuff. Uh, do I have any regular planks? Not a whole lot. We'll just use birch. That's fine. There we go. And then I'll need an iron ingot as well. And I will need my wand. Is there any... There's a little bit of V in there, but not a whole lot. Okay, so let's make the table first. And I believe it's just like... I think I did that backwards. There we go. Got the table. We'll come over to our arcane workbench. And there we go. And then we just drop our wand in there. And that gets us the spinning wheel. And then the spinning wheel can be used to make thread and stuff. So to do that, we're going to need some string, which we have here. And if we put four string in there, those will come together to form yarn, just like that. Pretty easy. So we're going to need quite a bit of it, actually, because if we look at the bag of tricks right here, which basically increases your storage space, we're going to need a whole bunch of these cloths of the spacious folds, and each one of them is going to require three yarn and a thaumium thread. And thaumium thread is also something we're going to have to make as well, but that's not too bad either. It's just basically string, two string, and two thaumium nuggets, right? So we need a total of seven of these. So that means we're going to need 21 of this yarn and seven thaumium threads. So let's make two more of these. And then we'll make a whole bunch of this yarn as well. Um, now, I'm probably going to run out of string. In fact, I'm sure I'm going to run out of string because that's going to make 10 and I need 21. So what we can do to get a little bit more string is we can grab some wool. We can grab some flint. And in our alchemical chemistry set, we can put the flint in with the wool. And that will actually make a bunch of string for us, which is pretty cool. It'll pop out four string every time. So let's just put those in there as well. And we'll see where we're at. This will put us to 14, 16. So I'll need three more. So we'll do two more flint. And that should be all the materials we need, I think. Right? Uh-huh. That looks good. And... There we go. Okay, so that's everything we need. Now we need to make... a bunch of these guys. All right? Now, each one makes... Oh, each one makes two. I thought it was one per... Okay. Well, we'll make eight. And how much V is left in here? Just enough for us to make a bag of tricks. Awesome. So, we've now got the bag of tricks. And the bag of tricks is basically just storage space. We can put all of our stuff in there. I think. Yeah. Just like that. Fantastic. That'll, that'll be very, very helpful for us to have. So, very, very glad about that. Now, let's just see if we go into our quest book. Thomcraft, open. Uh, I don't actually see a quest for that, unfortunately. That's too bad. Oh, well, it's fine. Um, this we're already done with. Some of the stuff we could probably get into a little bit, maybe. Maybe not. Hmm. Okay, 
Well, let me get some stuff together here, guys, and I'll come back to you in just a little bit. All right, guys, I am back. So I want to kind of try and see if we can figure out Miscraft a little bit. We have these unlinked books, um, and I'm not really sure. Can I shift-click those into here? No. Maybe into here? No. Into here. Can I do anything with any of these anywhere? Not like that. Yeah, I need to... Apparently you're supposed to make an unlinked panel. Or something like that. But I'm not seeing how you do it. Because if we, if we look in the quest book, right? You go to Miscraft. And here... We'll create... Oh! When supplied with ink, vials, and paper, the ink mixer will create linking pages. Oh! I probably have to do stuff here, I'm thinking. Total noob to Miscraft. I have literally never used Miscraft ever in the history of all of the time that I have been playing Minecraft. I have never done anything with Miscraft. So, this could be interesting. Uh, so let's make some paper. Um, let's just do at Miscraft. Here we go. So, to make an ink vial, it looks like I need a water bottle and ink. Okay, that's easy. So, let's go make some water bottles. We can do that without any real problems. One, two, three. Let's just make three of them. That should be fine. And... Then we'll put those in here and make an ink file. And we'll try that out. Okay, so that was here, the ink mixer, I believe. So black ink and a piece of paper. Ah, link panel page. Okay, so we did that. And then to copy a page, I don't really need to copy it at the moment. When supplied with leather, the bookbinder will create an age. Okay, do I have... Does this go... Oh, hey, don't, don't... No go on ground. Okay, so that goes here. And then it looks like it needs leather, I'm assuming. That's what it said. To create the binder. So we'll put a little bit of leather up there. And I'll just see... Maybe I should create a couple other pages first. That's probably a good plan. So let's just do this. Oh, wait, wait, wait. I gotta make the... I have to make ink first. Just kidding. Why do I have... Oh, because all the eggs are trying to fly at me from over here. Let's just pick them up. There we go. Ring of magnetization at its finest, folks. Okay. So we'll make a couple more of these. There we go. And let's just make a couple more pages. There's one, two. Okay. And in the book binder, we'll put those in there. And then leather. More leather. Maybe. Okay, leather definitely goes in there. Is this like a progress bar? No? Does it tell me anything about these? No, it doesn't. Uh, book one? Maybe? I, <laughs> I don't know anything about this stuff. Okay, let's see if it tells us here. So, to copy a page, I don't need to know how to copy a page. Allow you to create copies of the pages you have found, as well as providing an interface of all available pages. To copy a page, blah, blah, blah. When supplied with leather, the bookbinder will create an age out of the linking panels and any provided pages. So, it, I think we just need to do... Why is this not doing the thing? Because this is the bookbinder, right? And then do we just, like... 
are there any ages in here at all? Like, I, I feel like I'm doing something. Oh, no. No. Hmm. What am I doing wrong? Let's just look at Mistcraft here real quick. We've got a lectern. Sealed notebook, linking book, descriptive book, blank pages, writing desk, backboard. A bunch of different stuff that really doesn't make a huge deal of sense. Hmm. Let me see if I can figure this out, guys. I'll come back to you in just a little bit. All right, guys, I am back. I think what I may just need to do is create enough pages. Uh, I, I may just need enough pages to actually put in the book. Is that a thing? Maybe? Maybe not. I'm still... very clueless as to how this works. It was leather, right? It said put leather in the thing. When supplied with leather, the bookbinder will create an age. But I... I gave it leather. I gave it all the leather it could ever want. Age 1. I'm not sure why it's not working. Hmm. Maybe I'm a complete and total noob when it comes to miscraft. But, yeah, I don't know. I don't know what's going on there. Hmm. <laughs> Still clueless. It is what it is. Um, anyway. So I digress. Let's just put some of this stuff away. Uh, you... Oh, not you. You go in there. These books can go in here. Unless... Does... That go in here? No. No, it doesn't. And it doesn't tell me how to make a linked book. Link portal? No, it doesn't tell me that either. I don't know. Book receptacle. That seems fancy. Anyway, um, so yeah, I'm and now I'm just getting sidetracked. Uh, but anyway, let's take a little sleep here, real quick. There we go. All right. Now let's just take a look and see kind of where we're at as far as Botania goes. Our mana is doing okay. It's not amazing, but it's doing okay. Uh, we could probably stand to upgrade that a little bit, but I'm running kind of low on coal. Hmm. It would be good if we could find a way to generate mana that doesn't involve sucking up all my coal, and or charcoal for that matter. Um, let's just take a look at something here. If we go to at Botania, let's just take a look at this force relay. It's a piston. Looks like it does require a fair amount of mana to make that. Probably maybe more than I've got. And then we also needed... Ah, uh, man. I don't think we can do that right now either. That's too bad. Hmm. Okay. Well, why don't we do this? Why don't we just see what we can do as far as some of this other stuff goes? So, Botania uh, is kind of... I don't want to say it's shelved, although we could get into botanical brewing a little bit. That's not a bad idea. Let's take a look at the botanical brewery. Botanic... That's not how you spell botanical. There we go. So, living stone, a block of mana steel... Which I don't have quite enough for, but I will in a sec. Let's just make some mana steel ingots. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. There we go. That should make a block of mana steel for us. We've got the living rock we need. And then we need a regular plain old brewing stand. Which I can make easily enough. There we go. And then we need a Rune of Mana, which is 
One, two, three, four, five mana steel ingots and a mana pearl. Do I have a mana pearl already made? Doesn't look like it. Okay, I'll make a new one. No big deal. We'll do that. And uh, five mana steel ingots. Was that right? One, two, three, four. Yep, five. Okay. So we'll just do this. And start throwing some stuff in. There we go. Okay. That should be everything we need. So one, two, three, four, five. Mana Pearl. That's going to start turning into what we need. Uh, I will not need quite all of that. I should probably make some more living rock, actually. Do I have any smooth stone? I do. Let's just plop some of that down around this guy. There we go. Sounds like this thing is done and ready to go. So right click. There we go. That gets us our rune of mana. And then we can just put that in a crafting bench. So here, 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 and like so. There we go. That gets us the botanical brewery. Now we also need the mana glass vial. And a mana glass vial is made using mana glass, which is just regular glass thrown into the mana pool. So, we'll take three of these guys and go one, two, three, like so. And one, two, three. And there we go. That gets us some mana glass vials. And we can pick one reward. I already have nether wart, right? Yeah, I'm growing it right there. So we'll pick the... Reward bag, even though the reward bags in this mod pack are admittedly a bit lacking. Oh, that wasn't a bad one. Got a diamond out of it. Not too bad. We can always use more of those. We can always use more of those. That's very helpful, actually. Um, one of the more helpful things we possibly could have gotten, at least in my experience. So, we're good there. Now, we'll take the botanical brewery, and I'm just going to put it down... Uh, if I remember correctly, it needs a mana source of some sort. Like, you need to actually shoot mana at it. Uh, so I'm just going to put it down right here for the moment. And then it works kind of the same way as with everything else in Botania. There's no UI or, or anything like that. Um, I don't believe that opens up any new quests for us, though, does it? No. No, it doesn't. Okay. Well, that's fine. So, we got... A little bit done here with the bag of tricks. We got that done. We floundered and derped around trying to figure out Miscraft to no avail. So if you if you know Miscraft, please, please tell me what I have to do and what I'm doing wrong because I made a fool of myself, which happens. It's okay, especially when you're dealing with new things that you've never dealt with before. And we did manage to get the botanical brewery as well. So all in all, I am going to call it a successful day. But I am out of time for this one. So guys, if you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like, subscribe, and leave me a comment. I do appreciate it, and it really does help out my channel. You can also find me on Facebook, Twitter, and Twitch. There are links in the video description below, so check that out as well. Otherwise, guys, thanks for watching, and I'll definitely see you next time.